friends, I'm Ryan. This is Demos in the Dark. I was recently sent a box of Zvex pedals and asked if I could do something with them. You know, Zvex is is known for their really, really heavy rock stuff and really, really out there rock and noise music and stuff like that, none of which I do. Um, so yeah, I was up for the challenge and I got a box of rock, a Fuzz Factory, a Vibro Phase, and an Instant Lo-Fi Junkie. I, everybody knows what these pedals are. They've been around forever, so I'm not gonna like go through really in depth what they do. I'm just gonna tell you the stuff that I like about them. And um, I use them all on multi bass and keys and synth and guitar on that track. And that was the polished part, so we're gonna get into the decidedly not polished part. Um, when I go into a music store to try out gear, I don't come with a battery of licks and riffs. I find endless soloing to be a distraction. So typically, you know, I just play long, simple cowboy chords and stuff like that and listen to what it is the effect is doing. So that's what we're going to do here tonight. I have a McGinney Guitars Skylike here, and I am running into a Silk Tone Amp. Silk Tone Amp sounds like this. <laughs> So the first thing we're gonna start out with is the box of rock. This is kind of the original Marshall in a box. One of the things that I like most about this pedal actually is the boost though. So here's our sound right now. Throw on that boost. That's a really good sounding boost. And then the drive itself just sounds absolutely amazing. Take a Fender style amp and make it sound like a Marshall. is the Fuzz Factory, um, and I have owned several of these. Um, I do own several of these. I have some hand-painted ones. And very, very interesting uh, pedal. It's very unruly. Um, it is just like, it's just to the max all the time. There's a gate on there, which is really helpful. It has a very unique sound, and you know it when you hear it. Um, and I really dig it. I, you know, I, I know people go either way with it, but I, I really like it. the vibro phase this is one that i've never tried out before this um i remember when they came out with it and you know it's i usually see chorus and vibrato together this is vibrato and phaser and it makes a really really interesting set of sounds for you to mess with <laughs> Last but not least, the Instant Lo-Fi Junkie. 
I remember when this one came out and I bought it and uh, messed with it for a while. And I think I loaned it to somebody and haven't seen it since. Um, so the gist of this is that it is really just a, a lo-fi machine. It's noisy. It's compressed. Um, it has some vibrato going on. So there's some pitch shifting. And um, it's really just, it's a sound kind of all of its own. So it's, it's, it's really cool for the specific instances that you would want to use it for. Mm -hmm. 